Ken raising 75. We'll check out what he has. Jack 10 again. Loving that Jack 10. X, Y on the button, Ace, Five suited. Mayhem wants to play Jack, Five. Shout out to Jackson, Five. There's an Ace for X, Y. Wow, free card, Ken makes a straight. Can you get people trolling, guys, like? Do they say, Ken you're going to overbet. You're talking too little, all the chat. I don't think I ever get yeah. too little. And no, probably not too much. They want Sick. you to talk more. They want you to do like analysis. So during like the like, if I do one during the week, I'll like. Ken gonna pillage this one. He's going for the throat. Looks like. Because those pants get so crazy. Yeah. A thousand, two hundred or something. No, bigger. He's going for the throat. Overbet. Sixteen seventy into about a thousand dollars, so about a hundred fifty percent of the pot. Just going for the throat. But he also says stuff sometimes, and you're like, "What?" Like that's why you want to hear it. X Y makes a good fold. Think again, and I learned like that day. Especially like if I'm watching. Yeah. Like the announcers are great. Our commentators are great. It's probably like the only one that I would want to hear all the time is Nick Stillman. Other than that, I'd rather just Oh, he's hear really people. excellent at like. Oh, he's great. Like, he just Especially for me, it. like in a lot of the mixed game stuff okay. where I don't have as, you know, strong a knowledge. Like listening and to he his. He plays it. He's like an expert in all the games. So I agree with you. Yeah. Well, we gotta give, someone give Dan a shout out. Yeah, yeah, shout out to Dan Zach. Yeah, to what was it, a triple draw? Dan Zach? Mixed triple draw? Mixed triple draw. What, do you know what the prize was? What's the first one? Nice. How many points? VIP making 60 go. VIP the big winner, 1,500 today. Ma'am calls in the button, 6-5 off. Bow Bow, three bets <laughs> from the small blind. Ace, queen suited. He did? Julie picks up Jax in the big blind. Steep Just calls. Yeah, I know. Good fold by King Queen. Those mixed game fields are tough. Mayhem's on the button. Like, He's got position. It's like recreational players are all pros. Yeah, pretty much. He's gonna try to get a favorable flop. Shout out to Andrew Nimi. Open ended for Mayhem. Bow bow checks. It's gonna get checked around. Great card for Julie. Must know her jacks are good. Very small bet, 350. Mayhem's going to draw open ended. There's a full house for Julie. Very smart check by Julie because Mayhem checked the flop. Julie put him on a draw and it's going to induce the bluff.
Well played, Julie. If she bet, she gets nothing. Recognize the Mayhem at a draw since he checked the flop. So probably at a diamond draw or open-ended or a wheel draw. Scotty, 300 GBE, says he should have raised. Actually, that situation, a check call might be warranted because if Mayhem flopped a set, the sevens full of twos or fours full of twos beats jacks full or twos full of jacks or if mayhem actually had quads so basically julie would have to put mayhem on like checking five six sixes or something on the flop and then she would have to get called but there's a lot of situations where she would be drawing dead and getting there, so to say. I was like, I, I did not. Think to make it you, I did not think you had queens, kings, or right. Anything, You're only worried about a deuce. Two seventy-five. Not really. Scotty, three hundred. Not to discount it because we're not at the table. When you're at the table, you sense a lot more. So of course, I'm just talking about ABC play. Because you guys have seen me. I don't necessarily play ABC because I sense other things like game flow or try to get reads when we're playing at the table. Mayhem going to 3-bet AK. JJ is going to fold Queen 10 of Hearts. So this is not to knock anyone's comment. I want to encourage a discussion, especially if you're contributing to poker discussion. Thank you. Perfect. I just had that thought if I raise you there, what are you calling me with? That's <laughs> right. You know. Julie explained it correctly. Yeah, I'm either not, not I'm either not calling or you might lose. Unless I have pocket tape. Right. I'm probably getting it all in there. That Julie explaining why she check called there with the jacks, which is exactly as described. The guy had a busted draw or has Julie crushed with sevens full of twos, fours full of twos, or quad twos. 